Good morning, guys. I'm making a cake because this is what we're taking to Joel's family Christmas party with us today. And I cannot for the life of me decide if I have a 13 by 9 inch pan, do you just do one cake or do you do two? Everything says for one, but it, everything in me wants to do two. So I think I'm going to do two. And if it's too much, I won't put all the batter in. That's a great idea. That's what I'm going to do. <laughs> Don't let your hair get caught in there. That means I'd have to cut it. <laughs> hey Lincoln, do you want me to cut your hair? No. Okay. My hunch was right. It's two. Glad I went with two. No, Lincoln. Okay, we are not playing butt cheeks, butt cheeks, butt cheeks. Turn Hey Google off right now. Kids are basking in their wrapped presents over there. Okay, and who's watching Lady? Cody? <laughs> Cody, come and get Lady and clean. Boston, Boston, Boston! You come get all these little pieces of paper off the floor. So while we were at the store, while we were exchanging gifts for um, our siblings, I saw a couple things that I wanted for Christmas. And a couple of those things were these little, like, ornaments and this really pretty tree skirt. And I saw these uh, roller shoes, that, like you get these rollers and you put them on the back of your shoe. And those are really cool and I kinda wanted them for Christmas. And we were looking through everything and the boys just kept on seeing and seeing and seeing stuff that they wanted for Christmas. And I think my favorite part about Christmas is probably um, just spending time with family and like, at Christmas how like we like all wake up at the same time and like we all just like talk and have fun and like we we don't really fight and like we just it's just it's just so fun it like brings the magic of Christmas to our home it's just so fun this morning I really wanted to like put like these little like Christmas presents under the tree so I literally just took cardboard wrapping paper these little bows and tape and that's all I did. And then I took the wrapping paper and this one, mom thought it was a toilet paper. Toilet, like a toilet cardboard in the middle. No, I just cut up like a huge cardboard thing and like made it into a circle and then I put wraps over it. <laughs> and so I like them under the little tree. Hi Lee. I just want to wish everybody a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year because I think Christmas is the best time to spend time with your family, your friends, and celebrating Christmas in your home. And I just, and I am like so happy that I have, I have family, that I have a house, and that I have a room, and that, that I live here, and that I have a nice family. And so I just want to wish everybody a happy Christmas. Bless you. Thank you. <laughs> we made it to Joel's parents' house for the Holine Christmas party. Very, very exciting things happening today. Do you got everything? Holy na hoobity hubbity wuddy. And I told Joel when we got out of the car, I said, I am going to hurt our children. I'm I'm gonna hurt them. Mm -hmm. yes. They are pushing the limits, and I don't know if it's because Santa's on his way, but my god. They're supposed to be best behavior while they're waiting for Santa, but <laughs> no. I swear it's worse. Oh, it always gets this way. Parents, please tell me that you are all feeling this way, that your kids are getting wild and crazy and... Wanting to point out each other's faults. Oh! <laughs> you're doing this. You're doing the same thing. They could be doing the exact same thing and they're like, they're doing this. Oh, I'm gonna hurt them, guys. Yep. I, I, I'm gonna hurt them. No more kids in our vlogs. <laughs> Joel, your parents' house looks super nice. They simplified on the decorations this year. I think it looks really nice. I think it's good. All right, let's go inside. It's cold. Okay. We've had the AC on in the truck for a week. Or for yeah, a I was Freezing. like having hot flashes and... She's like, AC on. Everybody's shivering. Get in the house, Johnny Cupcake. You. Ledger, come here. Oh, you don't want to talk to me? That's Ledger, Cody's little cousin. How old are you, bud? You! Can you tell Uncle Joel how old you are? <laughs> no, mom, you tell me how big he is and old he is. He is okay, three and a half. And how much does he weigh now? 53 pounds. <laughs> That's seven pounds more than you and you're eight years old. 
<laughs> That's... He's a big guy. You're gonna be just a little guy and he's gonna be a big guy. Yeah. Your little cousin's gonna carry you around eventually. Gonna be our ball player. Mm -hmm. What's the pinata for, Cody? Our Christmas party today theme is going to be siesta. Right. So that's why we have a pinata and snowman and a Christmas tree because we're celebrating. Ooh. These are for the adults. Holy cow. Cody, you feel like we're in Mexico again? Yeah. I do. Yummy foods. We even have El Pastor. Love El Pastor. Ground beef and the rest is coming. And then we have guacamole. Bonnie made her guacamole. I'm pretty excited about that. Hey, Bonita. Yes. That's what I'm going to call you today because it's a Mexican party. Bonita. I'm going to go grab a bag of ice for my... What, what did you say? A padre? Padre. <laughs> His mijo needs... <laughs> Some ISO. How do you say ice? It's Anybody know? No. Did you finally find the plug to turn plug it in? Oh! What'd you tell her? Hey, what'd you tell her? Thank you, sissy. Hey, you're not gonna start acting too old for Christmas, are you? You're not gonna act too old for family fun, are you? Is it still fun to you? Good. Roger. Yes, <laughs> 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 Okay, now you gotta get up. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Lincoln, roll off. Lincoln, roll off. Lincoln. Lincoln, off. off. Oh, I know, like he's laughing now, but let's keep it that way. <laughs> <laughs> like a fridge landing on you, bud. My turn. My name is Uncle Joe Bottom. Oh, no. Oh, my God. All the weightlifting in the world. Save the children. <laughs> Do you guys remember when I fell down the stairs holding my new baby, baby nephew and it was like the worst day of my entire life because I fell down the stairs twice? I'll link that Christmas party in the description. But it was that little boy. Ledger, you're three years old. That was three years ago. What? You're six? You're three. And it came to pass in those days that there went out a decree from Chaser August that all the world sh should be taxed. It has always been a holding tradition that we read the nativity before we open a single present. Actually, let's back up. Tradition is you go deliver 200 newspapers, then... Wait, 500, 500. You, 200. No, it was five. 200, son. 200. It felt like five. <laughs> it felt like five? Yeah. That's because they were double. <laughs> yeah, Christmas. That was Thanksgiving. But the tradition is, is we read the nativity, then we say a family prayer, and then, this is kind of funny, but I think all of us boys just kind of came up with this with Grandpa, that Grandma opens the first president, not president, present, and we're going to stick to that tradition. She's going to open her president now, too. I guess Grandpa's on it, too. And the kids are happy with peanuts. For the second year in a row, we are going ice skating as a family, and it's kind of fun, new thing. The only problem is, is it's a pain to get all the kids set up for the first little bit. Because you got to get skates and laces on everybody, and uh, that's an ordeal. <laughs> Snow is falling down, I've been longing for this Christmas. When everyone's around to share this holiday. Yes, it's a time of happiness, a time of joy, but now this year is twice as special.
make out the heart but I knew what he was doing they would all like mouth I love you to me while they were ice skating and then I was watching all of Joel's brothers and I get comments every single day about how amazing Joel is to me and just amazing how what an amazing guy he is I was watching all of his brothers and they were doing the exact same thing to all of their wives they were being so sweet so good to their kids and it just made me fall completely in love with Joel all over again because of just the way him and his brothers are to their wives. It's just very admirable and it just made me really appreciate the family that Joel comes from. And so we wanna close the Holeen Christmas party vlog. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye guys. The snow is falling down. I've been longing for this Christmas. When everyone's around to share this holiday. Yes, it's a time of happiness, a time of joy, but now this